running a successful campaign online is no easy task a lot of moving parts there's an entire marketing workflow there are landing pages you're testing the landing pages you're working on the copy you're working on the colors the design and the actual offer itself but how about making the landing pages and your marketing workflow work harder than it should it can be done by using the principle of fomo fomo stands for fear of missing out and you can achieve that by using a single html element called countdown timer on almost any landing page that you'll ever build now most landing page builders today will come with a countdown timer element that you can simply drag and drop onto your landing page if you're using unbounce then there's a small workaround with html and javascript that you need to do to get your countdown timer to work on your landing page now with a countdown timer you can obviously create a sense of urgency for your campaign and you can drive your conversions way up so let's find out how to create a countdown timer on your landing page so inside the unbounce landing page builder we have a sample landing page that we are working on and it is an e-commerce offer where i'm making an offer of for about 10 percent off for anybody who signs up for my email list at the moment but i don't want to make it just in any just any offer i want to make it an offer that only lasts for about a minute i want people who visit this page to take action within that minute so i would like to create a small countdown timer right here under this text called offer ends in and i want to create that countdown timer here so that it displays there and starts counting down from the moment a visitor arrives on this page so let's find out how that's done before i do anything i would like to create a small text element so just drag a text element here under offer ends in but above the, the call to action button double click this and change it to something that looks like a timer there you go go back to that element select that element double click on that element that you just created now you will find this view source here click on view source and you will find a little bit of html right here which is which happens to pertain to the piece of text that you just dragged in and created for your timer now this particular html text element will have the usual html components such as paragraph styling for the paragraph and what is called as a span element now what you need to do is you need to add what is called as a class a css class called timer so now you need to add that class called timer to the innermost span element inside that html element there's only one span element at the moment so i'm just going to go ahead and create a class which equals timer there you go and click on done now this is a very important step and i hope you don't miss that if you want you can just go back and replay this video to ensure that you get this step right the next step is to visit github by using the link that will be provided to you in the description below use that link go to github come here and copy this particular script that's called countdown.js get back to your landing page find this tab called javascripts click on javascripts click on add new javascript name this so that you know what kind of a javascript that is name it as countdown timer paste it on the head section of the page click on done click on save now if you preview this page you will find that the countdown timer is, is there and is starting so get back to my landing page here on unbounce landing page builder click on my particular javascript that i wanted to make the changes to if you notice the script it says variable start time 0 0.25 and it says it's a set countdown in minutes now i want to actually take advantage of that i want to make it a minute not some seconds and just let it go at that i just want to click on done click on save and preview my page so as i visit this page it starts from one minute and counts down so gives gives the visitor an ample time to make a decision as to whether or not he can sign up so that's how you add a countdown timer optionally you can also choose to style that particular timer any way you want by using another code on the same page that you've been to on the github there is also another section called countdown.css you can copy the style section and change it to whatever you want and add it to to the styling section the css section of the unbounce landing page so i hope that helps if you like this video please like and share it please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to receive notifications every time we upload a new a new video thank you so much for watching